Here we have 1.1 solving a two-step equation with signed decimals. So same thing as before, I see fractions. So the first step is to eliminate those fractions. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna multiply five to every term, every term, no matter what the term is. So here, this eliminates the fraction and I'm just left with V. Five times 3.2 is 16 equal to five times negative 9.5 is negative 47.5. Now the next step is to, um, if I go through all of them, next step would be parentheses, but I don't have any. Next step would be combine like terms. There's no like terms on this side. This is a variable, this is a constant. And there's only one term on that side, so nothing to combine. Step four is move all the variables to the left-hand side. There's only one variable and it's on the left-hand side. And then five, move the constants to the other side. That I do need to do. So I need to get this constant and move it over to the other side. So I'm gonna minus 16 on both sides. and I get negative 63.5. And then the last step would be divide by a coefficient, but there's no coefficient here, it's just an invisible one. And if you divide this by an invisible one, you're going to get the exact same number. And let's try another one. Here the common denominator is eight. So I'm gonna take eight times negative 2.48, eight times 18, plus eight times this fraction. Notice I did eight times every single term. So eight times negative 2.48 is negative 19.84. Eight times 18 is 144. And here this eliminates the fraction, which is the purpose of multiplying by that common denominator. Then I would try to distribute the parentheses, there's nothing to do. I would try to combine like terms. There's only one term on this side and these two terms are not the same on the other side. Then I would try to move all the variables to one side. There's only one variable and it's over here on the right hand side, which means the next step is to move the constants to the other side. So this 144 needs to get subtracted to the other side. So I have negative 19.84 minus 144. That gives me negative 163.84 equal to the U all by itself. And again, there's nothing to divide here. So this is the, the final answer.